All the attention on Tony Cross. Well, for me, Derek, his greatest attribute is his ability to combine with teammates, particularly in tight areas, in and around the box, have a little one-two, little passes around the corner. He's the player that could be key to breaking down this defence. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live from the Bernabeu here on EA TV. It's very much a temple of football, the Santiago Bernabeu right here on the Spanish capital, Madrid. I'm Derek Ray, your match commentator, and alongside providing all the tactical analysis is Stuart Robson. I'm looking forward to bringing you action from the Spanish top flight, La Liga. It's Real Madrid up against Granada and threading it through. Textbook defending inside the box. Oh, might be. Keeper did his job to begin with. So a corner here. Played over. Oh, a really good header. But the goalkeeper there to cover up. Danger averted for now, but it'll be another corner. Trying to pick out a teammate. Not the result from the set piece they were looking for. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Well, as we look at the table, the opportunity very much there for oh, the Oh, he's through on goal here, Derek. Can they put it away? Surely now. Well, not cleared away completely. Well, the Real fans can sense a goal coming here. They're certainly creating some good opportunities now. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. Callejon. Saar now. Callejon. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Corner awarded. <laughs> and deciding to go short with this one. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. I'm sure quite a few people were asking the question, what is the manager thinking about playing him in this position? But he has adjusted really well to it, and who knows, we could, Stuart, see more and more of this. Well, not all players can change positions and still play well, but he's proved that he can. I think he's done a really good job for the team and the coach. Victor Diaz, Saar now, Callejon, it is a decent looking attack here, but nothing comes of it, Jose Lu. oh he's left his marker for dead, corner for Real Madrid, Who's going to get on the end of it? Well, no real accuracy and easy for the keeper. Carvajal. Garcia. 
Delightful pass. Well, he's been ruled offside. Real Madrid regaining possession. Vallejo. Here's Manafa. Wilson Manafa. Sergio Ruiz. Here's Manafa. Moving it forward. Well, let's see about the cross. And in the end, no damage done. Real Madrid have given it away. How can he take them on and beat them? Chance to play it in. And given the defender's touch, the referee says corner. And there's the delivery. Not really the ideal clearance. Can they forge ahead? They do. And you've got to say they're good value for the lead. Well, here it is again. And the clearance just isn't good enough. Giving up possession in a dangerous area. Just poor defending all round. underway and 1-0 it is let's see what happens next Aurelien Chouameni well getting close to the half-time interval with Real Madrid behind what have you made of it so far Stuart well I've been a little disappointed with their attacking play it's all been a bit too slow if they can pass into their front areas with more quality switch play quicker and be more positive in 1v1 situations I think they'll get back into this Making headway, Tony Kroos. That's a nice looking ball. Clearance left a bit to be desired. Well, they can bring it out now. Malong Saar. And the first half is in the history books here at the Bernabeu. Well, we usually think of Vinicius Junior as somebody who can win a game on his own, but he's being kept quiet here. Yeah, he just hasn't been able to affect the game so far. He hasn't had too much of the ball, but even when he has, he's not looked threatening. Resume catch selected. So back in business, the ball moving again, and Real with a bit of work ahead of them. The switch of play now. Well, patient passing could be the key to bringing themselves level. Sean Weissman. Now breaking at pace. Potential danger. Well, they're going to be very cross with themselves because that was a wasted opportunity.
And a quick reminder, we've got more football from La Liga coming up for you live here on EA TV. It's Real Madrid against Real Betis. And defensive play to be applauded. Sergio Ruiz. Uzuni. Ruiz. Passing it accurately. Well, that's common sense refereeing to play advantage. Trying to open them up. They've gone and scored again. They're doing everything in their power to make sure they're not pegged back. Well, here's the replay, and he shows great awareness to play this through ball. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. Well, back to the drawing board, I'm afraid. His team have been really poor today. So underway again, and a 2-0 advantage here. Bellingham. Now Eder Militao. 30 minutes left for play. Valverde. Here's Carvajal. Good work from Granada to win it back. A more exciting La Liga action coming up for you here on EA TV. It's Granada and they take on Athletic Bilbao. Oh, he's left his marker for dead. Really fine piece of defending play to break us up. And they will make the change now. For Real Madrid. Elects to go short. Deciding to go inside. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. Real using width to good effect. And that's gone out of play for what will be a goal kick. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Things. Here's the substitution. Just twenty minutes remaining now. Gumbau. And beating the defender. Good idea. A goal here. Giving his team precisely what they were looking for. Now he deserves to celebrate it. Well, let's see this again. The vision to play this through ball is superb. And his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. Well, that's not a happy manager. He knows he's got a lot of work to do now. This is looking rather comfortable for them. 3-0. Danny Ceballos. Uzuni. Determined defending. He successfully got past him. Valverde. And he clears it out of harm's way. That's effective pressure. High up the pitch. Andrej. It's with Danny Ceballos. Uzuni. Into the advanced position. Oh, great play. 
Callejon. Can he take the chance? He had to react and did. Is it going to be? And there it is, a goal. But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings? They haven't been at the best. Well, here's the replay. He's done well to get his head up, pick out a teammate, and from there, he never looked like missing. That's a lovely goal. So back underway at 3-1, Sergio Ruiz. Saar now, Gumbau. Victor Diaz. The referee knew that was foul play, but advantage it is. Good tackle. No danger here as he runs at them. Some of the fans are screaming, have a go. Oh, a smart stop. They favoured a short one here. Well, using the space really well, but now can they push on? And defending as a unit. The final whistle, and not to be for Real Madrid. They have to accept defeat. What did you think of their performance as a whole? Well, Derek, the fans are right to expect more. The tempo of their passing was too slow. They were second to the ball too many times and were beaten by the better side today. This performance in this particular game will have impressed many people, Stuart. Well, that was a great performance. His understanding of how to find space was brilliant today. And, of course, he scored two really good goals. Casper's pace is the underscore pace underscore game underscore against underscore career underscore press underscore underscore highlighted.